Hi, I'm Varsha and you're watching this video from JustTutors.com and in this video we are going to learn about factorization and in factorization we are going to learn two methods today which is the method of common factor and factorization by regrouping terms but before moving ahead we'll try some warm-up questions here are the questions for you to try these questions you can pause the video so as you can see that in question number one we need to find the factors of 30 the factors of 30 would be 2 cross 15 3 cross 10 5 cross 6 30 cross 1 so the factors would be 1 2 3 5 6 10 15 and 30 so these all are the factors of 30 and in question number 2 we need to find the factors of 24 pq so that would be 2 cross 2 cross 2 cross 3 cross p cross q so these all are the prime factors of 24 pq we can find other factors of 24 as well and then we'll times pq with them in the same way that would be also an answer of the question now we move ahead to our topic which is factorization by different method so basically we'll use four different method for the factorization and we're going to discuss about the method of common factor and factorization by regrouping today you can find the other two options or we can say the other two ways to factorize the algebraic expression in other videos now we are going to discuss about method of common factors so basically whichever question is being given to you first of all we'll look at what all are the common factors of both of them so here it is 5xy so the factors would be 5 cross x cross y and 25y we can say that would be 5 cross 5 cross y so 5 and y are common so we can say that we can take 5y as common and we are left here with x and here with 5 so we can say that the answer is x plus 5 times 5y or we can recheck the answer by doing multiplication so 5 y times by x so that would be 5xy plus 5y times by 5 so that would be 25y so the answer is same that means the answer that we have got here is correct so we can say that 5 cross y cross x plus 5 these all are factors of this given term similarly we can find the factor of 3x plus 9 so the common is 3 and we are left with x plus 3 inside so 3 and x plus 3 are the factors of 3x plus 9 now we move ahead and we're going to learn about factorization by regrouping term now if we have been given with a long equation or we can say there is a long question being given to us now we will ask to factorize them so first of all we'll regroup the like terms together and the unlike terms to the other side so here we can say that 8y minus 12xy this is the first group 6 minus 9x this is the second group so we can write it like this out of these that would be 4y as a common so we are left with 2 minus 3x here the common is 3 and we are left with 2 minus 3x so we can write it like this now equation 1 and 2 could be written as minus as a common here so 4y 3x minus 2 and here minus as a common again so this could be rewritten as minus 3 3x minus 2 now putting equation 1 and 2 together we can say that would be 4y minus 3x minus 2 minus 3 3x minus 2 so 3x minus 2 is common so we put the 3x minus 2 again and we're left with minus 4y minus 3 so this is the answer of the question similarly you can try and factorize this question by using regrouping the terms so as we can see that this is the first group 
and this is going to be the second group. So out of these, 3 y is common, we are left with x plus 3 plus 5 is common and we are left with x plus 5. So this is going to be the possibility of this answer. Now we move ahead and there are some practice questions. You can try these questions and to try these questions you can pause the video. So you have the answers for these questions. You can match the answers and you can pat your back as you are working really good in understanding the method of common factor and factorization by regrouping terms. Thank you for watching the video. For more please visit justutors.com.